Hello audio lover, today I'll show you how to repair and clean scratchy and annoying noisy volume controls, input selectors or tone controls in a very simple way. If you also love to use good quality hi-fi from the 90s, then from time to time these integrated stereo amplifiers tend to get that noisy sound when you change the volume, or even one of the left or right channels stops working. Most often. The culprit is oxidized contacts in these potentiometer pots, which are used for both volume control or tone control knobs. To do this, you will need courage. If you are under 18, you will also need to ask your grandmother's permission, because doing things wrong can lead to the graveyard and we certainly don't want that. Then you will need to buy a cleaning spray. There are different types, you can buy them on internet or in special electronic shops by searching for Scratchy potentiometer cleaner spray. These sprays contain oil, which can be used to restore corroded electrical contacts, which is exactly what we need. Then we need a Phillips screwdriver and a kitchen paper towel. Once you have found the necessary items, unplug the appliance and disassemble the machine enough to get to the specific scratchy control potentiometers. This may be slightly different for each amplifier but most often it is enough to remove the main case cover to get to the potentiometer. For this amp, the noisy potentiometer is right next to the volume control, while the crackling input selectors are a little further away on the main board. In this case, you have to clean these switch contacts on the main board before the input selector. Once the noisy parts are found, Put a paper towel around them so the cleaner spray doesn't get as much on the board and other electronic elements. Once the paper is placed, just blow the potentiometer cleaning spray through the open slots in the scratchy potentiometer. Then turn the volume knob. Leave it turned to another position and blow the cleaning spray again. Repeat this several times. And at the end, you can collect the excess moisture with a cotton swab. Clean the noisy input selector switch in the same way, then screw the amplifier back together, plug it in back into the power and evaluate the result. Amazing! Sounds like new and no more scratchy and annoying noisy noises. If you still experience them, it's worth doing the same potentiometer and switch cleaning again. If after the second time nothing improves, you can think that the switch or potentiometer is worn out and needs to be replaced, but this is very rare indeed. In 90% of cases, it is enough to clean them with the right spray. This way, you will save a lot of dollars without going to an electronic service and you will be able to enjoy quality music again without annoying noise. If you found this video useful, feel free to hit the like and subscribe buttons so we can meet in other useful audio tech videos. Good luck!